Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the clutch assembly in your hedge trimmer, make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. To reduce the chance of injury, we recommend keeping the blade cover on for this procedure. We also recommend emptying the fuel tank. Set the trimmer upside down and use a T27 Torx bit to unthread the screws, securing the gear case to the engine block. Use a 3 quarter inch socket or a spark plug wrench to loosen the spark plug then unthread it. Confirm that the piston is in the down position. Then insert a cord into the cylinder to prevent the piston from moving. You can use a half-inch socket drive to help unthread the old clutch assembly. Install the new clutch assembly by threading it onto the crankshaft, then tighten. Remove the cord from the cylinder and rethread the spark plug. Be careful not to strip the threads by over tightening. Realign the gear case on the engine block and secure it with the screws. Be sure to secure the grounding wire under the appropriate screw. With the repair completed, reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug, refill the fuel tank, and your hedge trimmer should be ready for use.